Hello and welcome students installing Microsoft 365 into the practice labs project and here in this video this is going to be really general video for you students because in this video we are going to show you how you can simply download the office 365 from the portal and this video is going to be same and it's going to be a generic in nature because here you will see how to download the setup of Office 365 from your Azure tenant and from your Microsoft Office 365 tenant account. And then the further steps related to its performance and related to its configuration and management, we're going to show you different sort of hands-on in the coming videos. So let's move to the document. Let's move to the manual and then we're going to redirect to the practice labs platform so here's your dear document dear manual and here we only have the installing office 365 and this is the practice labs login and here's the step-by-step -step screenshots for you guys so you can easily follow each instruction closely and clearly and then replicate on the practice lab servers so as you have seen in the screenshots and plenty of previous videos that how you can make it here on the PLAB Win 10 and for this project it's specifically you're going to need the PLAB Win 10 the client machine we're going to use because as for the Office 365 we need the client machine because we are going to install the application so we, we, we don't need to manage those cloud application from the domain controller that's why we are directly choosing the client machine for the installation so here for login you need to do what you need to just click and open the browser and once you see the IE you should type what portal dot office dot com and when you type that link it will if your search engine is set to the Bing or the Google so it will show you the best link on the top and select the login link and option and it will redirect you here and here I'm going to use my account for this lab specifically but these credentials will be provided by the provided by Danish and once you start getting in this course and once you start the labs so these credentials will be provided before starting the course so here the account is ali at gssdmv dot on microsoft dot com and then click next and now you can see that when i type the id here it shows the gss banner behind that login dialog box which we pre-configure in our tenant account now here i'm going to type nine the password oops i just spell out the first corrector so here I'm gonna type the password to log in to the office 365 portal and here it shows you this option here so to install the office you can directly click here to install the office and when you click here so it will provide you two options that if you want to install the office so your selection would be the office 365 apps or the other installation options you want to check so we will go to the office 365 apps here and here you can see it directly start downloading but but if you select the second option let me show you the choice here what we have if you click to the other install option so it's gonna open the product category and wide range of options and you can add and you can remove any of the app that you want to install or don't want to install so here you will have the app permission and a lot of stuff now here if you scroll up it is giving you some detail about the office so you can click to view apps and devices and it will show you that what are the apps and what are the versions you have like the 64 bit or the 32 bit it's up to you and on which machine it is already installed 
so it's not related to this project but you can find out from here and here you have another option like Skype for business if you want to solve it that that's only the Skype for business so you can click to install it or if you want to download the whole suite so you can click to install office just against this option and you'll see that screen you can click to save and it will download office 65 into your machine and once it done then you can execute or click to run the setup and there you go the installation and the deployment of the office 365 is started so that's how you can download the office 365 from the portal.office.com and then these steps will help you to start the installation and installation is quite easy it won't ask you so many questions because it's automatically downloaded and installed in your c drive so it won't require a lot of inputs from the user so it's going to be really smooth and once it's done then in the coming later videos we're going to explore office 65 apps and their functions and how to avail different benefits from this whole office suite so that's it for this video